is Bournemouth nil, Manchester United one. Manchester United collecting three points today on this ninth fine Saturday. Yes, three points. A goal from Casemiro himself. Brilliant um, goalkeeping displayed by David here to ensure he keeps a clean sheet. Defence did well, but I have to be honest. Today was, of course, important to get those three points and get a lot, get closer to securing Champions League position. Level on points with Newcastle, especially after Newcastle played yesterday and, and just blew out their uh, opponents like it was nothing. Against Brighton Munich, especially them. But today, Manchester United... Did what they had to do. Three points, but the performance, you can say, uh, you know what? Yes, at times we was in control against um, Bournemouth, but we would like more than one nil. Clean sheet, clean sheet, clean sheet is beautiful to see. 16 clean sheets in a row for Manchester United that shows the display. But guys, can we not score from set pieces? For God's sake, only seven this season. Better than last season because we only scored about one or two under that scrub only going to social. But it is what it is. Let's talk about that first half because Manchester United in that first 45 minutes. Yes, we had dominating spells of possession at times. as But Manchester United, with that ball in the final third, we're just not it. We just can't get through that final third. And especially with Marshall leading up the front, which you question yourself. This guy's not fit. Marshall out. Seriously, simple as. Marshall out. But yes, Casemiro with the goal. To be honest with you, it was brilliant build-up play between between Sancho, Bruno as well. Then, of course, coming the ball, coming from Christian Eriksen. Eriksen with a, a scoop, the ball scooping over for, against the defenders of Bournemouth. Casemiro, lovely volley, bicycle. Oh, what a goal. Casemiro, Casemiro. This guy has been unbelievable this whole entire season. And what a defensive midfielder he is. The best defensive midfielder we've got we've seen in the premier league so far this season the guy getting another goal just showing his true leadership i mean he had a one absolutely fabulous match man the match display for me today defensively solid connecting getting the ball as well spraying it as well being involved in the attack as well and getting the goal one note to match united at half time was thinking again this match united needs to get the second goal you know, we can't afford to just keep it like this and coast throughout the second half. But that's what we did. We coasted in the second half, Manchester United, because we wasn't that great in the second half. We was riding it through. David De Gea did so, had some fantastic saves. And, of course, Manchester United bringing up Alejandro Granacho. I saw Martial coming off, shrugging his shoulders off because he had one hell of a stinker today, Martial. And it just shows me and it tells me we need to sell him. And he knows it's going to get sold at the end of the season because he just has been poor even though he's been injured but when he's come back he has been poor same as Jaden Sancho as well the match finished one note to Manchester United because Bournemouth couldn't get anything done Manchester United couldn't get a second goal in but the match finishes one note to Manchester United we collect that three points and we are happy happy date for us because we've got two homework games left Chelsea as well Fulham we are going to collect these three points and finish as high as possible in the Premier League we're just hoping that Newcastle flops so we can finish third and then if we finish third and we've gone towards the FA Cup final the momentum should be great it should be good maybe we have some hope of beating Man City uh, guys who am I kidding we we have no chance we saw Man City blizzard Real Madrid the champions are holders you know like they were nothing but it is what it is today as well coming regarding the, the players casemiro wonderful performance from him today defensively everywhere intercepting as well just solid in certain situations and of course getting that goal marshall as i said before that guy needs to get sold he's poor anthony marshall another poor performance another poor display from him as well and again, he got the goal, but he couldn't get a back-to-back -back goal. Can you believe it's been three years since uh, Martial has got consecutive goals? That just tells me he needs to go. Aaron Bissaka was solid today going forward, man. That guy, too good, man, Aaron Bissaka, man. Defensively, has improved so much going forward as well. He has the improved guy, whether you like it or not. Man, the match today, guys, has to go to Casemiro. Casemiro's def the solid defensive display for Manchester United, just showing how vital and important he is. To this Manchester United team. It is what it is. Well, Manchester United fans, this has been your match reaction from your boy Ivor and Spice. Let me know who your man the match yesterday. 
let me know who your donkey of the match today is as well because mine i don't i can't really tell you to be fair probably going to be marshall as donkey of the match and also let me know your thoughts on the game today as well and as always we're back live on monday for the catch up at 8 p.m uk time to discuss this match with the man so make sure you tune in and also live on thursday 5 30 for the mansion night live news as well only on youtube twitch, i mean so stream across all social media platforms youtube twitch and also facebook as always guys this has been your match reaction remember to keep it united and remember to keep it ready now your boy is out peace out and see you there sayonara boom one nil we win another three points yeah